A long-term squatter on Māori land in Taranaki has raised the stakes by building a house on the Waitara property. The local council says the structure is illegal and the Māori Trust doesn't want him there. But the former gang member says it's his ancestral land and he's sticking to his guns. Reports. A home with a sprawling deck in a dream location on the beach. But New Plymouth District Council says this Waitara house is illegal. The council here on Māori land have no say. I just disregard what they're saying, just don't take no notice. Kevin Moore, his whānau and friends started building the house less than two months ago without proper consents. It's on Māori land run by the Rohutu Block Trust with around 170 registered owners. Mr Moore's not one of them, but he claims ancestral links and has been squatting on the land for three years. We have the rights we have, um, to do what we want. That's what I believe anyway. Some of those big trusts don't work, they just work for themselves, they don't work for the real people. The former Black Power member was acquitted of murder in 1992 but later jailed for seven years over conspiring to pervert the course of justice in that case. Kevin Moore says his past as a gang member shouldn't be part of the issue despite claims of intimidation by some in the community. He says he's taking a stand for his family and it's about homelessness. My family. They're struggling out there beyond that gate there to get a house to live in. There's about 10 people living in one house. My brother Kevin's stand here is merely reasserting his right as mana whenua. Both the Trust and the New Plymouth District Council wouldn't appear on camera about the issue, but in a statement, the Council said it's organising to meet with the trustees about having the building consented. Meanwhile, Kevin Moore says he's had the property blessed and he, his family and their new home won't be going anywhere. Kevin Moore is digging his heels in, arguing he doesn't need permission because the home is on Māori land. This is Kevin Moore's little slice of heaven. One bedroom overlooking the ocean. It's simple, sturdy and illegal. I have uh, <clears throat> every right to be here where I am. I am tongue to whenua. The Black Power gang member built this home on Māori land at East Beach in Waitara without applying for consent from the council. As far as I'm concerned, the council have uh, no say on Māori land. And all I can say to our people out there is if you're on Māori land, just carry on and do what I'm doing. The land is owned by a Māori trust that also did not give permission. Experts say it's highly unusual. I've worked in this business uh, 35 years. Uh, never seen a, a whole house being built without a building consent. The law clear, there's no exemption for Māori land. The same rules apply wherever the land is. The New Plymouth District Council refused to appear on camera today, but will now try to inspect the building using a code of assessment, usually reserved for far smaller repairs and extensions. If they can't come to a resolution or the land trustees want it gone, a demolition could be ordered. Moore is unafraid and vowing to continue. I'm just going to keep on doing what I'm doing here and, and keep building. And keep enjoying his little slice of heaven for as long as he can. He haki tino ranga tiratanga e pepepe ana ki runga ki te kainga o me mamangu kaha Kevin Moore ki whaitara. He whare whakatū poka noa nāna ki runga whenua Māori a kaore i a mo te tuohu. I have uh, <clears throat> every right to be here where I am. I am tongue to whenua. I've been guided by my tūpuna. I am here, a katiaki, a da whenua. And uh, I have perfect rights to be right here. And what I'm doing, is nothing wrong. He whakāhua o te tūpuna rangatira o wiremu ki ngi te rangi tāke e iriana ki te pātū whare. Engari, ahakoa te whakapapa o moa, ko tā te runanga o rohutu e hara ia i te uri whaipānga ki e nei whenua. There's 170 so-called uh, uh, owners of the block here, but somehow, mysteriously, our iwi, our people, we've just been scrubbed out. But, uh, yeah, if it has to be, they want to know more about that, well, then we can dig deep, dig deep, dig deep and find out why that happened. E tū taki ana te kaunihira ārohe o ngā motu ki ngā kaitia ki o te papakainga ki te whakatakoto ara whakamua mō ngā whare. Me te whai pepa whakai te kaunihira mō ngā whare hōu. They can come along and inspect the building. 
But as far as, well, I ain't going to be paying for anything if they want to do an inspection or anything for, from the council. As far as I'm concerned, the council have uh, no say on Māori. <laughs> Yeah.